I'm looking forward to the, the public seeing through all this bull crap here at the end. Our top story tonight, the race for Struthers Municipal Court judge is heating up tonight. And one candidate is hoping some recent accusations don't impact the outcome. Now remember, that court also serves areas like Poland, Lowellville, New Middletown, and Springfield Township. Good evening, I'm Dave Sess. I'm Mandy Knoll. Democrat Dom Leone, who you just saw, is running against Damian DiGenova. Tonight, Leone is defending himself against some pretty tough accusations. First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti has our top story at 6. With only weeks left until Election Day, the accusations swirling around the Struthers Municipal Judges race are growing. In my opinion, it's a classic smear campaign uh, put on by my opponent's supporters or his operatives. Democrat and current Struthers Law Director Dom Leone is running against Republican Damian DiGenova. Late last week, two women filed separate sworn statements, both claiming to be former girlfriends of Leone's. Both women claim they saw Leone taking improper contributions, and one says she saw him using marijuana. Not true. Not true. But the statements come less than a week after a pair of dueling police reports were filed by Leone and Republican Don Manning, who's running for state representative. They both accuse each other of menacing after an alleged confrontation at a bar in Poland Township. Leone admits he dated both women and had them working on his campaign at different times, but thinks they've now been put up to attacking him. You don't really know someone until you get to, you know, you start dating them. How would they have that in their mind unless it was something that was discussed? I don't know the answer to that. But Attorney Ron Yarwood is one of DeGenova's law partners. While the candidate would not comment on the allegations against Leone, Yarwood is more than willing to do so. When you cumulatively add it together, it gives me great concern about his judgment. Of course he's biased, you know. And, <laughs> Obviously, uh, my law partner would probably say the same thing about uh, Damien. At this point, no action's been taken concerning the allegations. Leone says he's hoping none of it affects the outcome on election night. Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.